Okay, so let's do a couple things here, just basics. I want to inter- I want to educate the people that are not familiar with this stuff. What is the NCA Clearinghouse, and what does that do? Corey, the NCA Eligibility Center. <laughs> is that now the new name of the clearinghouse? Yes. Okay, yes. cool. No, All right. Yeah, no clearinghouse anymore. Okay. The NCAA Eligibility Center is a department within the NCAA that um, makes sure a student is one, an amateur, and two, academically prepared to go to university. They also have other departments such as high school review, which is typically deals with domestic high schools or Canadian high schools um, outside of Quebec in most instances and they also have a academic review team and the academic review team reviews uh initial eligibility waivers so if a student is an academic non-qualifier meaning that they didn't meet certain criteria academically based off of just their high school record um they the, the university might file a waiver on their behalf because there may be mitigation such as covid or you know somebody passing away or um a war in their country etc um, so all of those departments, they also have, I'm sorry, they also have a customer service staff. So they have a staff out in Denver and then they, um, they also have a staff in house that answers, uh, public calls and also answers, um, the membership institution calls, uh, and walks through, maybe they'll walk through a case. So if, you know, a student athlete is missing something and the member institution calls in and says, Hey, student XYZ, what transcripts are they missing? Or why is the review like this? Then they'll be able to explain it to them. You know, hey, student XYZ is missing a transcript from this high school and we need, you need to contact the high school to get the transcript in so the student's file will be complete and then it can go on to academic review. So there's several departments that kind of work together within the entire eligibility center. 